underneath our 1972 Mercedes SE. We'll first start off with the oil pan. We move to our side. We have our passenger side coil spring as well as brake. And as I move to the other side, we have our driver's side brake and coil. Moving down the center, we have our control arms. Running into our transmission pan. And transmission. We have our dual exhaust running down the center of the car that run into a single muffler and run right out the back looking at the rear axle rear end shock absorber as well as the passenger side shock absorber and as I move down the body we can note that there is no rust protrusion anywhere Our gas tank. And there we have it. Looking under the hood of our 1972 Mercedes 280 SE. We'll first start off with our master cylinder and power brake booster. And as I move to the front of the car, we have our valve covers on our eight cylinder motor. our ignition coil and right next to that we have our master cylinder excuse me power steering reservoir in front we have our distributor cap and on top we have our air cleaner And as we look to the other side of the motor, we have our washer fluid reservoir. And right in front of that, we have our fan and radiator. And giving it a full view, we have our 12 volt battery. If we go ahead and start the car, 